From the MPG Production Studio, this is the game where high hands can lead to high rewards. Welcome to Net Poker. And now, here's your host, the master of the card, Raymond Scrub. gentlemen and welcome in to another edition of net poker right here at mvg productions glad you could join me here once again uh we have returned with three more contestants here ready to try their luck at the cards and see if one of them can take down that outlaws jackpot currently standing at one hundred and two thousand five hundred dollars let's see if one of these three contestants can do it starting with a man who's returning back to the show making his second appearance on the show this season so far as one his first time through won himself eight thousand five hundred dollars in cash we have mr nelson ezra Nels, welcome back sir hello thank you for having me yeah made it made it through to the uh final round your first time through you think you can do it again here tonight oh yeah oh yeah all right, well, best of luck to you once again. Thank you. And our other two contestants we saw in our previous episode, we have Travis back with us with uh, $6,000 in winning so far. This is his fourth appearance on the show. And Justin tying our record with uh, the most appearances so far this season, back with $11,500. Gentlemen, welcome back. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, you've met all three contestants. No need to wait any longer. Let's go ahead and jump right into our first portion of the game here. This is the video poker round. You know how this works, so we're going to start you off with each with 10 points. Got five trivia questions for you. Each one you get right will get you an additional 10 points added to your bank. Uh, but, and remember, a uh, person with the least number of points will get the crack at the cards first on this one, all right? So, let me make sure I got everybody's buzzers unlocked here, and we're all set and ready to go. Buzzing keys at the top of the screen, players, and here we go with our first question today on net poker. In the classic nursery rhyme, why did Jack and Jill go up the hill? Nels. Ah, to fetch a pail of water. You are correct, sir. Ten points for you. You're up to 20 and off and running. All right, players, next question. Which word can mean to put, uh, which word can mean something put in soil to grow, or a type of snooker shot involving two touching balls? Mm -mm. <laughs> and that's time. No. Uh, the correct answer there is, it's a plant. Oh! Plant, plant's what we're looking for. Uh. Uh. Yes, that's okay. Well, that... <laughs> That's all right. No, no harm, no foul there. Yeah. All right, players. Next, uh, next question. Which piece in chess cannot move to an adjacent square? Is it the king, the queen, or the knight? Nails. I. What was that? The knight. Knight is correct. There you go. Thirty points. So I don't want to keep losing an L sort of shape there. Okay. All right, two more questions to go on this first portion here. Here's your next one. If someone is feeling blissfully happy, they are said to be on what? Nails? Cloud nine. Cloud nine is correct. Mm -hmm. yeah, well done. Nails sweeping, swiping all the questions in this round. One more to go. Here it is. Players, how often does the World Athletics Championships take place? Is it every year? Every two years or every four years, Travis. Two years. Two years is correct. Yes. Very good. So at the end of our question round, Nails has forty points. Travis has twenty points, and with ten points, Justin, you get the first crack of the cards. Are you ready? Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Just uh, you might want to back away from your mic just a little bit there, Justin, because it sounds like you're eating it. Again. There we go. That's better. All right. Let's, let's get you right to the cards here. I know how this works. Again, you're going to pick five cards off the video wall. Remember, we use the deck nine through ace. Make your best five-card poker hand you can, and you will score yourself some points. And, of course, as always, the better your hand, the better, you, the more points you'll score, and here's how it breaks down. Of course, you're looking to catch at least a pair of queens or better, because that will get yourself five points. Uh, if you get less than a pair of queens, that's going to cost you five there. And the scale goes right up the 
four for um, two pair for ten points. Uh, three of a kind gets you fifteen. The straight gets you twenty. Flush twenty five. Full house is worth forty. Four of a kind is worth one twenty five. Straight flush is two fifty. And if you catch that royal flush at any point during one of the three main portions of the game, you not only will you score yourself one thousand points, but you will get yourself an automatic buy, almost an automatic guaranteed spot in our championship game by earning yourself $100,000 in cash and winning a brand new Chevy Camaro worth $49,000, okay? So with All right. that said, let's get right to it, Justin. Let's shuffle the cards for you. And go ahead and pick out five cards. Affleck. Starting with his favorite number, 22. He gets a jack of spades. <laughs> nine. Number nine. A hey, king of clubs. What team? Queen of diamonds. Two. King of hearts. Seventeen. And seventeen. The king of diamonds. Ooh. Got trip king so far, sir. That is worth fifteen points. You want to keep the keep three of a kind, or redraw and try to make a better hand. I'm going to see if I'm going to try for a full house. Okay. So, which cards you want to get rid of? Get rid of that jack. All right. So you're just you're not gonna go for the four of a kind. You're just gonna try to get a full house out of it. All right. The jack goes bye bye. You're looking for either the fourth king for 125 points or a queen to make a full house. One card, sir. Which one would you like? Five. Number five. And five. We have. Ace of Diamonds. Ah. Sorry, you still got three of a kind, so that is worth 15 points. Put you at 25 for now. We now go to Travis with 20 points. Travis, you ready? Ready, ready. Here we go. Shuffle the cards. And go ahead and pick oh, wait, five I'm numbers sure. for me. Uh, uh, let's go with eight. Eight. Not a hearts. Oh, boy. Five. Ace of Diamonds. Um, no. Uh, 16. 10 of hearts. 19. That's the ace of hearts. Awesome. And three. Three is a nine of clubs. You got yourself two pair right now, sir. That's worth 10 points to you. You can keep it, or you can try to make your hand better. What do you want to do? I'm going to try to make the hand better. All right, which card do you want to get rid of? Um, let's go, let's uh, drop the nines and the ten. All right, dropping the nines and the ten. Keeping the pair of aces for now, trying to make that four of a kind possibly. Get three picks. Eighteen. Eighteen. Jack of Diamonds. Alright. Um, yeah, 23. 23. King of Spades. And 15. 15. Look at the pair something and 15 gets. And Ace of Spades. There we go. Trip Aces for you. That is also 15 points. <laughs> You've got 35 now. And now Nell's over to you with 40 points. Are you ready to play? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Shuffle the cards for you. Go ahead and pick five numbers for me. Let's go with uh, five. Number five. That's a queen of clubs. Let's go with uh, nine. That's a ten of spades. Okay. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. That's a queen of hearts. Thirteen. A jack of diamonds. Oh, um, two. Two. Ace of clubs. That gives you a pair of queens right now. For it's worth five points. Keep that hand, or you can redraw and try to make better. Um, let's keep the queens and pick the three remaining. All right, we're gonna drop everything but the queens. Get three yeah. more picks. <sighs> Twelve. Number twelve. Ten of hearts. Twenty. 
a king of diamonds. Sixteen. Sixteen. A nine of clubs. So you finish with a pair of queens, which is worth five points, giving you a total of 45 points, and you are tonight's VIP. Yeah! All right, now that means you are headed off to the VIP lounge here with, her, with some product uh, to enjoy some snacks and beverages, courtesy of our friends at Pepsi tonight. But before you do, you get a chance to earn yourself some more cash to add to your total, sir. Pick a letter in the word poker. We've got cash up there from $500 to $5,000. Whatever you find, yours to keep. Let's take the K. All right, little K. Get you $2,000. Very nice. Where Thank should you have gone? Number, letter E oh, right next to it. I Shut I up on an E. Ah, uh, well. That's okay. 2000 more to your total brings you up to $10,500 for the season, bre breaking five figures, getting close to just the total there. And you're going to yeah. head off to the VIP lounge to compete in our final round. So, folks, we're going to pause for the cause and take our first commercial break. When we come back, Travis and Justin are going to battle it out, playing a little five card poker. See if one of them will take on nails. We'll do that right after this here on their poker. Welcome back to Net Poker here. Now this is tonight's VIP. Enjoy some time at the Pepsi Lounge here tonight. But now um, Justin and Travis are going to battle it out playing with five card poker. All right, Travis, uh, you had the lower score of the two, so you're going to go ahead uh, and pick the card where we're going to cut the deck in this round. Give me a number between 1 and 24. All right. Um, seven. Number seven. All right, players, here's how this round works. I'm going to ask you another trick. I'm going to show you two cards off the top of the deck, and then I'm going to ask you a trivia question. You get the question right, you're going to get yourself 10 points, and you get to pick a card to help comprise your poker hand for this round. First four cards will be face up, and then um, first four questions will have the cards face up, and each of them are worth 10 points. The final two cards will be face down, and that question will be worth 15 points. All right? At the end, we'll reveal your poker hands. Uh, so whoever has the better, higher poker hand of the two will receive a 25-point bonus. And remember, the, pers the um, person who has the most points in this round will go to face nails in our final round. Okay? So with that said, let's get right to it and take a look at our first two cards off the top of the deck for this round. King of Clubs and the Ace Hello. of Diamonds. Hello! Here's your question, players. Uh, pay attention. Buzzing keys are on the top of the screen there. Here comes oh, your yes, yes. Here's your question. In the cinemas, what does the certificate PG stand for? Justin. Parental guidance. And that's correct. You've got 10 points. Which card would you like? Ace. All right, the ace is yours. Your cards will be on the bottom, Justin. Travis, you'll play the cards on the top. We'll take a look at the next two off the top of the deck. The same cards, Sharks. <laughs> All right, I know this. We but know that now. But that's how this is designed, sir. Get back to the lounge. <laughs> All right, ten of hearts and a nine of spades for you. Here is your question. What nursery rhyme character could eat no fat? That's Travis. Jack Sparrow. That, that is correct. Ten points for you. Which card would you like? Um... <laughs> No point. Actually, not really. I could, uh, uh, let's get to 10. All right, 10 is yours. You've got a king high versus justice ace high. See the next two cards. King Ew. of spades and a queen of diamonds. All right, players, history question for you. In what year did the First World War begin? Was it 1910, 1914, or 19... Travis? Uh. 1916. No, I'm sorry. It's not 1916. Uh, Justin, I'll repeat the choices again. It was 1910, 1914, or 1917? 1914. That is the correct answer. Well done. Ten points for you. Which card would you like? 
Give me that king. All right, taking the king, blocking, tra blocking Travis from uh, uh -oh. getting that cards there. Uh, let's see. He said he wanted the king. There you go. All right, you still got the ace high in the lead, Ryan. Let's take a look at the next two cards. Jack of uh, spades and a king of diamonds. So it's gonna get a pen no matter what. Yeah, control very important on this one for you. Here comes the question. All right, players. Which planet was downgraded to a dwarf planet by astronomers in 2006? And then, Justin. I mean, sorry, Travis. Not me. Yes, Travis. Holy oh, Huda. Yeah, I looked at the wrong light there. Travis, you are correct. It was Pluto. I wasn't even lit. Yep, 20 points there. Uh, Travis, which card would you like? King of Diamonds, please. All right, the king is yours. You now have the pair of kings, and you have the lead for now as we go to our final cards. Of course, these cards are face down players. This is a 15 point question. Here it comes. All right, players, Total Recall was the title of which Hollywood star's 2012 autobiography? Justin. Arnold Schwarzenegger. You are correct. Mm. 15 points for you. You have the lead with 35 points. Which card would you like, the left or the right? The right. It's not a tumor. All right, the right card is yours. We look at the hands as of now. Travis has the lead with a pair of kings. Justin, oh, King. Justin has a ace high, but we'll see what happens. We flip the final cards in three, two, King. one. King! Oh! Travis with a ten. Uh, Justin with a nine. That gives Travis two pairs, kings and tens. Uh, Justin has a pair of nines with an ace high. Travis gets the 25-point bonus and wins the round. Oh! oh. 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 Well done, sir. Well done, indeed. All right, so that means you're moving on to face nails in our final round. But oh uh, lord! And you get yourself a chance to uh, earn some bonus money here. Pick a letter of the word poker. R, please. Letter R. Letter R gets you seven hundred fifty dollars. Where was the big money this time? Under the K. For oh, now now it's over the K. All right, so that's seven fifty for you, Travis. That brings you now up to six thousand seven hundred fifty dollars, and you'll be facing nails in just a moment. But we got to say goodbye to Justin here. You played a good game Whoops. with us, but you're not gonna leave here empty-handed, sir. We're gonna give you ten dollars for every point you score in this round, which is another tree fitting, giving you a grand total now of eleven thousand eight hundred fifty dollars for the season. Well done. All right. I right, look forward to having you back on another episode. But as for now, folks, we're going to take another commercial break. When we come back, Travis and Nails are going to battle it out playing a little joke of poker to see who gets a shot at that Outlaws jackpot now over $100,000. Who's going to win it? Find out after the break here on Ed Poker. Welcome back to Net Poker here. It's now time for our third and final round of the main game. It's time to play some Joker Poker. Now he's back with us from the VIP round and he is now his box to pick up the deck, sir. Can you cover between 1 and 26? I feel a frisky. Uh, 18. 18 it shall be. All right, players, this round plays just like our previous round. The only catch is this time we've added two Jokers to the deck. As you know, Jokers are wild. It's like a great series here on the channel. All you have to do is, <laughs> all you have to do, if you find one of the Jokers, you can turn that into any card that you want to help build your better poker hand. Remember, the player who wins this round will go on to our final, our bonus round for a shot. The Outlaws jackpot again worth over $100,000 in oh. cash tonight. So let's see if one of y'all can take it home. Let's get started here with our first two cards for this round. <laughs> Oh, suited. The king and the ace of clubs. We'll see what happens here. Make sure the buzzers are unlocked for our contestants here. The buzzing keys are at the top of the screen. And here is your first question of the Joker Poker Round. 
Which instrument is larger, players? A viola or a violin? Nels. Viola? That's correct. Ten points for you. You get first oh, track of the card. Oh, decisions, decisions. Give me the ace. Feeling you were going to take that. Ace is yours, okay? Yeah. Nails, your cards are on the top. Travis, yours is on the bottom. Here's your next two cards off the top of the deck. Ten of diamonds and a jack of spades. Here's a question. Venison meat comes from what animal? Travis. Deer. Oh, dear. You're correct. Uh, I was going to say buffalo. <laughs> Ten points for you. Which card would you like? Um... The Jack. Jack and Shelby. Jack is yours, and all tied up 10 points apiece. And Nails with the lead with the ace high, however. Next two cards. <laughs> Looking at a 10 wow. either way here. So, 10 of spades, 10 of clubs. Here's the question. In the board game Monopoly, what color are the hotels? Nails. Red. Red is correct. Very good. Well, which ten am I going to take? Give me the ten, ten of clubs. Ten of clubs, all right. So you get the ten of clubs, gives you a pair of tens now. Uh, Travis, working on a straight draw, if you can catch a couple more. Next two cards. A king of spades and an ace of hearts. Let's put a monkey wrench in the things here. Here's the question. A real monkey wrench. <laughs> Art players... It takes the Earth just over how many days to orbit the sun? Nels. 24? No, I'm sorry. Incorrect. Travis? 364? No. Can't I think I know. It to you. It's 365. Yes, 365 and one quarter days to orbit go around the sun one time. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. I, would, no. I would have accepted 365. Oh, thank you. It's okay. No harm, no foul. We've got another 10-point question here. Here it is. True or false, players? More people are killed each year by lions than crocodiles. Nails. False? It is false. You're correct. Give me the ace. I had a feeling you were going to take the ace. You have two pair now to Travis. Yeah. Uh, pair of kings. We go to our final two cards, and they are face down. And you're the oh, this Lord. is a 15 point question, Travis. You must get this in order to stay in the game. Okay. Here is your question, players. What animal represents the star sign Pisces? Travis. Fish. The fish is correct. I would never got that. 15 okay. Points for you. Uh, which card would you like? Left or the right? Left. Left card is yours. All right. Looking at the board, Nails has a two pair, aces and tens. Travis has a pair of kings. He's looking to catch a third king to get that three of a kind and get the 25-point bonus. Let's flip those final cards in three, two, one. Nails with the queen of clubs. Right. Travis with the nine of clubs. Nails has two pair. Travis still has a pair. Nails gets the bonus and wins our tonight's run out. Yes. Good game. Good game. Came down to the final cards there. Well done, Nails. You've won yourself the game, and now you have a chance to earn yourself a, to ten thousand dollars in bonus cash, sir. You get okay. to pick two letters in the word poker this time. Remember, if you find the top two amounts of five thousand and two thousand, I will give you a bonus three thousand dollars for a total of ten thousand bucks. The K. And which other letter? The E. All right. First off, the K gives you one thousand dollars, and the E gives you five thousand oh. dollars. There we go. So six thousand dollars. What was the two thousand? If it's the automobile, because nope, it was oh, no, it's the P. That was the P. Yeah. Okay. All right, but okay, six thousand dollars in cash for you, sir, gives you a total now of sixteen thousand five hundred dollars, and you're going on to face the outlaw here in just a moment. But Travis, <laughs> unfortunately, we got to say goodbye to you again, my friend. But did you have a good time with us this time? Always. All right, we're gonna give you some. We're gonna give you uh, again another 
ten dollars for every point you score this round. To go with the cash that you won in the first part of the uh, second portion of the game, you've won another thousand dollars tonight, bringing your total up to seven thousand dollars even. Congratulations. Trucking along nicely. <laughs> yep, trucking along nicely. Mostly to add some more money next time you uh, join us here for the show. And with that said, folks, we're going to take uh, one more commercial break. When we come Ooh. back, Nell gets his shot at the Outlaw jackpot over $100,000. Will he be the first one to finally beat the Outlaw? Find out after the break right here. Oh, oh God. Welcome back to Net Poker. It is now time for the final round of the game. Deuce is wild, where we get a shot at the Outlaws jackpot of one hundred and two thousand five hundred dollars of cash. We're here with Nels, who is our big winner of the day. Nels, are you ready to take take down the Outlaw? I want to try. Yeah, I, I'm feeling ninety five percent confident here. All right. Well, let's see if you can do it. You know how this game works. We're gonna give you, yep. we're gonna give you four rows of cards. Each of them we're gonna add one. Start with one outlaw. We'll add an additional outlaw for each row you go down there. Your objective is to avoid the outlaw and find the deuces because the deuces are those wild cards which will help you build your final poker hand should you not beat the outlaw. However, if you can find four one deuce in each row of cards. You will have beaten the outlaw, and you'll win his jackpot of one hundred and two thousand five hundred dollars. Okay. So with that said, best okay. of luck to you. We'll start you off with the first row here. We have five deuces and one outlaw. Which card would you like? Brody, what number you think? I'm gonna ask for help. Uh, uh, try two. Number two, please, sir. Looking for a deuce behind the deuce, and number two gives us. A deuce! Yes. How convenient! How convenient, yeah. One down, three more to go. Our uh, second row, we have four deuces and two outlaws this time. Which card would you like? I'm going to try 11. Number 11. Behind number 11 with this time, we have... Yeah! Oh! Yeah! Law, yes. Ah, damn. Another episode, and we can't give away the jackpot, but that's okay. You still get two more chances for wild cards to help for your final hand, sir. Go ahead and pick one from this row. You have three deuces and three outlaws here. Fifteen. Fifteen. Fifteen gets you a deuce. There you go. And now for the final row, two deuces, four outlaws. 20. Number 20. Behind 20, we have... A deuce! Oh, no! Oh, are you kidding me? Again. We, the, you Danger get, bro again. You get past yeah. the hard row, but you can't find the outlaw, beat that law on the easy ones. All right. Yeah. Well, uh, unfortunately for you, Nels, you don't win the Outlaws jackpot tonight. But good news is for the next player who gets a shot at the Outlaw jackpot, we're going to add an additional $2,500 for the one Outlaw you found, bringing the total now up to $105,000. Jackpot keeps growing, but now your cash total has a chance to keep on growing as you play our final round of Deuces Wild, sir. Go ahead and cut the deck between 1 and 24 for me. 12, please. Right down the middle. Okay. Yeah. We're going to deal two cards face down in the window up here. You're going to pick one. We're going to add it to your poker hand there. And then you'll get a choice to make the three deuces that you found into any card that you'd like to make your final poker hand. Now, remember, the higher your hand, the more cash that you score. Three of a kind is going to get you $500. A straight gets you $750. A flush gets you $1,000. Full house pays you $1,500. Four of a kind is worth two thousand. A straight flush gives you five thousand dollars. Five of a kind is worth ten thousand dollars. And if you can make a royal flush, that is twenty thousand dollars in cash. All right. So best of luck to you. You got three wild cards. So you got a good chance of making that royal flush if you can do it. That's what I'm hoping for. Right. Um, First pick, you just need to find a ten, a jack, a queen, a king, or an ace. Um, let's go for the white, the right card. The right card gets him. A nine of spades. 
All right, you won't be able to make the royal flush, but you can still make a good, you can possibly make a straight flush or even a five of a kind if you can find another nine. You got one more pick left. Which card would you like? The left. Hopefully it's a nine for you for some big money. But remember, uh, the left card is a ten of spades. All right, you now have to make your other three wild cards, whatever cards that you'd like. Starting with that first deuce, what do you want to turn it into? Ace of spades. Now, you realize if you turn it into the ace of spades, you will not be able to make a hand, sir. Okay. That is true. You can make a four of a kind. Try king of spades now. The, 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 uh, the best hand that you'll be able to make is a straight flush. Let's do the straight flush, then. Um, do the king of spades. Do a king of spades, okay. That next deuce. Um, jack of spades. Okay. And finally, the last one. The queen of spades. And those are the cards you need for a straight flush, worth five thousand dollars. <laughs> and that right there is about as close as we've gotten to seeing an actual royal flush outside of the uh, bonus round there but very nice sir well done that's five thousand dollars more bringing your total now up to for this season a grand total of twenty one thousand five hundred dollars in cash for two games very impressive work sir thank you and with that with that win right there that puts you into just as a quick glance at the Cash total, you're now currently sitting in third place, sir, which puts you in the championship game for the season if your, to <laughs> if your cash total holds up, however. We yeah. St we still have five more episodes to go after this one to determine which three contestants will be playing in our net poker se season. Who did, I bump out? Who did I bump out, Eric? Yes, you, oh, bumped, you bumped out Eric on this one. But we'll see. There's still time left for our contest all contestants to get back in here and try to win some more cash. Will we have a Royal Flush one on the next episode? Will someone ever beat the outlaw for the jackpot? You'll have to find out on our next episode. But in the meantime, between time, thank you so much for watching the show. If you like the series and you want to see more of it, all you got to do is click check out the playlist here on the channel. And if you have not subscribed and you want to see more great game show action, click that subscribe button down below and ring the bell. That way you never miss out on all the fun and games going down here at MVG Production. And until the cards are dealt your way once again and we get another shot at the Outlaws jackpot, I'm your host, Brandon Scruggs, saying thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time right here on Net Poker. Take care. Bye for now, folks.